Wendy Williams received criticism from her own audience for her remarks against Beyoncé. Wendy Williams began her career in radio and rose to fame for her candor and contagious spirit. She also became notorious among the numerous celebrities Williams frequently discussed. She finally landed her own daytime talk program and rose to fame in American homes. The 13th season of Williams' Emmy-winning program was, unfortunately, the last. Beyoncé was one of the many famous people Williams discussed. The singer frequently appeared in the show's Hot Topics section. Williams, though, made a comment about the diva during one particular show that upset Beyoncé's rabid fanbase. Williams wasn't there when the 13th season of her daytime talk show, The Wendy Williams Show, premiered in October 2021. The host had a number of medical concerns, therefore she took an indefinite leave of absence. To take her place, a number of substitute hosts were hired, among them Sherry Shepard. The production firm, Debmer Mercury, realized by 2022 that they couldn't continue with the show. Shepard was given the opportunity to host her own show to take over Williams' time slot after her appearances, as a guest host were so warmly received. Later, it was revealed that Shepard's show Sherry would debut in the autumn, and Williams' show will air its final episode at the conclusion of its 13th season. Williams admitted to disliking her show's concluding episode to the New York Post. She claimed that the production firm had not requested her presence when the media outlet questioned her about why she hadn't shown up. I didn't do that because Debmer Mercury didn't request that of me. I watched it while sitting in my apartment. And I exclaimed, eek. She spoke. Williams also expressed to the publication her opinion that she ought to have hosted her final program rather than the other guest hosts. But when Fat Joe and Ramai Ma co-hosted, she made an exception. Joe is Williams' favorite, she claimed. When Wendy Williams launched The Wendy Williams Show in 2008, her famed style of celebrity analysis had already become a mainstay on American televisions. Over the years, Williams welcomed a ton of famous people as guests on her program. There were numerous instances, though, in which she would enrage a celebrity's following or even the celebrities themselves. Williams discussed Beyoncé and a documentary the singer was planning to release on HBO in 2012. Williams acknowledged that she was a fan of Beyoncé and emphasized how contentious the topic was. She stated that the majority of the attendees at her Hot Topics meeting refused to watch it because they believed it would not provide anything novel. Wendy Williams has just introduced a brand new podcast called The Wendy Experience, showing that she isn't letting the end of her popular talk show get her down. Given Williams' history of providing opinion on the most recent celebrity hot subjects, the former radio disc jokey and talk show host's transition into podcasting has been widely reported for months. Williams' manager, Will Selby, gave The Sun an exclusive interview in which he revealed further information on the undertaking. To begin with, Williams' $4.5 million New York City apartment will serve as the location for recording the show. In addition to the audio, Selby has verified that there will also be a video component. The show already has an official Instagram account. Selby stated that they had not yet recorded an episode at the time. He mentioned Fat Joe as one of the names being considered for the first visitor. Williams and Selby started working together while he was her jeweler. As the two grew closer, he disclosed that he first introduced Williams to the podcast idea when she was still serving as the presenter of her talk show. Williams and Selby went to collect items from the set, including the famous purple chair, when the show's cancellation was announced. Williams sat in this chair each morning for her Hot Topics show. According to Selby, the new podcast will also feature the purple chair. Fans are eager to experience Williams' candor and fabulousness once more, despite the recent difficulties she has encountered on the personal and professional fronts.